my back garden here at Melia Fushi. Oh yes, we are gonna be doing a great leg and calf workout. We're gonna be burning through the next 10 minutes. So the little tip that I'm gonna have for you today is to make sure that you stay hydrated. Water is so, so important. It's actually gonna help you lose weight as well by getting all those toxins out of your body. So drink more water. Okay, so we're gonna get started. We've got 10 minutes on the clock. And we're gonna start off with just our feet about hip distance apart. And we're just gonna rise all the way up into those tippy toes and then back down again. You can kind of swing those arms up through and take it down. So we're gonna be focusing on those calf muscles, but we're gonna get a whole leg burn. So we're helping, you know, just tone up, slim down those calves, and you are gonna feel amazing. And if you are on my 30 day get fit plan, whoo, well, you have got a great day. Leg day is always fun. Okay, now rise it all the way up to the top, and then we're just gonna hold. So you've got a slight bend in the knee, your, uh, your belly button is tucked underneath, and we're just gonna pulse here. You've got little pulses at the top. Take it nice and slow. At any time that you feel that you need to drop your heels down, just do it for a second and then come back up again. Okay, we're gonna go back to where we were at the beginning. We're gonna rise all the way up. Oh yes, already you're starting to feel those calves working. That's it, have a slight bend in the knee, keep that chest up for me, and just lift up. Give me a smile, because we're gonna get through 10 minutes of this workout and you are gonna feel amazing at the end, but we have got to finish it. Okay, remember we're gonna come up to the top and we're gonna go back into those pulses. So that's it, really gently. Woo, we've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and release down. Okay, you can really start to feel it. We're gonna make sure that we get a stretch out afterwards. Okay, next exercise, we're gonna have our chest up, we're gonna go down into a squat, and then back up again, okay? So just a single leg squat. We're gonna work in those glutes there, we're working those calves, and then squeeze those glutes as you get to the top. That's it, take it nice and low, and all the way up. Ooh, now if you want that added challenge, you're gonna keep that leg out in front of you. This is also gonna work your core, okay? Improve on that flexibility and that stability. So we're gonna take it down here and just hold. Oh yes, you can start to feel that burn in the quads. You can feel it in those calves as well. And we're gonna pulse. Take it down for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, switch over to the other side, give it a little bit of a shake. And we're gonna take it here and all the way up. So either modified version, you take it down, bring that leg back together, squeeze those glutes, or the more advanced version, you're just gonna lift it and hold it up at the top. So it doesn't matter where you are right now, guys. Let me just tell you, it does not matter where you are in exercise, it matters that you are here right me, with me and you're doing this workout. Okay, so hands together, squeeze those glutes as you get to the top. Oh yeah, see if you can take it a little bit lower each down. <sighs> Breathing in. And like I said at the beginning, water, hydration, it's so, so important. And we're gonna take it down and hold it here. So that's it, try and keep that chest up for me. Okay, your belly button's kind of pulled in towards your spine. That's it, you've got a nice support in that leg. And we're gonna pulse for five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, you can jump out of it anyway. It doesn't matter if you fall. Okay, you're gonna come back up onto those tippy toes. Okay, you're gonna take a nice bend down for me. What we're gonna do is touch out to the side. Okay, so we're really keeping up onto those balls of the feet. Modified version, you're gonna come down and put your heels down. So if you can, try and pop up onto those toes. And it's amazing. You're not even jumping up and down, but you're still doing leg day because you can really feel that burn in those calf muscles. Okay, let's pick up the pace a little bit. That's it, take it a little bit lower in that bend. And if you want to, you can even add a resistance band in at this point. Okay, that's gonna really make sure that you are burning those calf muscles. Okay, you've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now hold those legs together, we're gonna go into a second set. So squeeze those glutes all the way up to the top and come down. So you're all the way up on your tippy toes, squeeze those glutes, and take it down nice and slow. So this is really great for you know balance and your stability, so you're working that core as well. See if you can get a little bit lower. I'm still all the way up onto those toes. Take it down, and then squeeze those glutes as you get all the way to the top. Okay, you've got three more here. Take it down, squeeze those glutes. Two more. Get a little bit higher up on those tippy toes. And last time, take it all the way down, and lift and squeeze, hold up at the top. Really go onto those toes for me for three, two,
two, one, and release down. Okay, we're gonna give a little bit of a stretch out now because I know we've been really working those calf muscles. So you've just got a 10 second rest here. So lift up, you're gonna hold for five, four, three, two, one. Over to the other side, you're just gonna a little rest here and lift up for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, shake it out. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna face the side, to whichever side that you wanna face, okay? You're gonna come to your top of your mat and all you're gonna do is you're gonna do that same single leg squat. You're gonna come to the middle, okay? You're gonna lift up onto those toes, squeeze those glutes, tuck those hips with me, and then you're gonna switch over to the other side and take it out. So that's it, so it's nice and slow. Bend in the middle, bend all the way up into those toes, really high. Take it down and into that single leg squat. Now that's it, so you're really breathing the whole time. You don't have to be moving so much to really work your body and to get great results. So I recommend doing about 30 to 40 minutes of exercise, you know, five to six times a week. And if you're thinking like, oh my goodness, I don't know if I can fit that in, then you've got to check out my calendar, okay? It's got the exact workouts to do when, it's got recipes, it's got a tick off calendar, so it's going to keep you on track. Okay, all the details in the description below. So we are five minutes in, and we're gonna hold it up here in the middle. So hands to our chest, and then out to the side. Okay, hands into the chest, tuck those hips underneath, and out to the side. And this hand movement, this just makes us think that we're doing you know, something without feeling that burn in those legs. Okay, bring it in, and then out to the side. Oh, you're doing great, guys. We're working those calf muscles, and hold it out here for five, four, three, two, one, and release. Okay, we're gonna go back into a, like a nice wide plie. Okay, so our hips are really tucked underneath, and you're gonna sit down, and all you're gonna do is you're gonna lift up that toe, lift up that heel, and push down into that toe. So that's it, so you need to have your he hands on your hips, and we're just really lifting up nice and high onto that ball of the feet. Now, we're gonna gear it in a little bit harder, and increase it, so let's go up to the top. That's it, now just hold here. Really push up onto those toes and hold for five, four, three, two, one, and bring it back down again. Okay, you have a little bit of a shake out. We're gonna go back into it again. So lift up those toes for five, four, three, two, one. Okay guys, can we do one more? Yes we can, let's take it even lower and bring up onto those toes for five, four, you've guessed it, three, two, one. Okay, and take it down and slowly walk your heels in. Okay, how are we feeling everybody? Let's keep on powering through. Those legs are gonna start to tingle. So the next exercise we're gonna do is we're gonna go use that single a leg squat again. So you single leg squat down here and then you're gonna curtsy to the back. That's it, so we're really using those glute muscles and we are working those calves as well. Okay, so let's take it down. Keep that chest up as you do that curtsy lunge. Woo! I hope you're sweating. I hope you're getting that heart rate up just a little bit. But really, are we're focusing on using those legs. Okay, we're focusing on those tiny little movements that's gonna make all the difference. So keep breathing in and out. Let's see if we can get a little bit lower. That's it, you've got this. Now, if you want to, you can add in weights. Okay, you can hold in weights here, and that's just gonna increase the resistance. So it's not gonna make you bulky overnight, okay? It is just gonna get you a little bit more resistance. Okay, let's do two more on this side. Take it down, and out to the back. Woo, good job, now straight over to the other side. No rest, leg out in front, and to the back. So you, the harder version is you're not gonna put your foot down, okay? All you're gonna do is you're gonna hold it out here, squat goes here, and then out to the back, and down. Okay, squeeze, and out to the back. Yes, guys, come on, let's keep that energy up. Let's keep on going. You wanna work those legs, you wanna to get toned, you wanna to slim down those thighs, you wanna work those calf muscles. We're gonna do this together all the way through to the end. Chest is up. You've got five more on this side. Are those legs starting to burn? Oh yes, I can feel it. And make sure that you guys hashtag, I can feel the burn Rebecca, after you've done this workout so I can find you. Okay, you've got two more on this side. Take it down. Whew. And last one all the way down to the ground. Okay, good stuff everybody. We're gonna go back to really working those calf muscles. So, go all the way up onto those tippy toes and then come down. Oh, it's interesting. Every single time that we come back to this exercise, you can feel it a little bit more in those calf muscles and that's totally normal. Now, if you often get cramp, okay, maybe in the middle of the night that you're feeling something in your calf muscles, probably means that you're just a little bit dehydrated. 
Okay, so we're gonna hold up at the top here. Tuck those hips under me. <sighs> Lift up for me. Okay, yes, you've got it up here. Work that balance. You've got less than 60 seconds to go. Oh my goodness, we can do this. So we're gonna take it down. We're gonna bend those knees. Oh yes, how's your balance? And we're gonna pulse. <sighs> 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna bring those heels in together and we're gonna go all the way up to the top and take it down. Yes, those are calf muscles are killing. I know they are, but we can do this. All the way up to the top and you're gonna plie out and again, pulse. We are working the legs, guys, with a little bit specifically on those calf muscles, but keep on going, keep on pushing through for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, all the way up to the top. Take it down. You've just got 10 more seconds left to go. We're gonna raise all the way up onto those tippy toes. Come on, guys, lift your arms up as well. Oh, breathe in for me. We have got five. You can count down with me. Four. Don't stop now. Three. And two. And all the way up to the top. And gently come down. Oh my goodness. Shake your legs out. Make sure that you finish the last workout that you did get fit so that you can be put into the prize draw. And if you are not already a member of that, then check out the description below because it's all there for you. You can check out more of my behind the scenes of my travel and what happens in going into making you guys some epic workout videos. My name is Rebecca Louise. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye-bye.